His long boy is locked safe in the black market auction house. Yeah, it's snoozing in one of those really expensive containers. One day I'll wake it up. I've almost given up trying to get those containers though. They they um the frustration for me is that I have to be I have to be uh getting into a bid war like what is for me quite late in the evening, which means I usually forget to do it. Um, and even then I have to spend outrageous amounts of gold on each one of those containers quite simply because all the gold that I have is on high pop realms where there's also lots of other people trying to buy those containers. I could do with one day just transferring 10 million gold to a like zero population server just so I can buy those containers on the cheap. When we um when we spread our wings a little bit and dive into the pet market and start getting to the point where we've got like, you know, a million or two gold on like 10, 20 different servers, then then we'll probably start buying those containers a little bit more seriously. Until that time though, there's a uh, until that day comes, I don't think there's uh, much chance of me getting many of those containers. I was mainly buying them for the YouTube content. I'm, gonna, oh, I'm not going to lie. Uh, I never expect to actually get anything decent out of them. It's like buying a lottery ticket and expecting to win. You're just an idiot. They might add another auction house mount. Unlikely. The, the, in my opinion, the main reason why they took the long boy out of the game in the first place is because they realised that, well, actually... The thing that brings people to the main capital cities more so than anything else is the auction house. Uh, and to give people the ability to just hop on a mount and get access to the auction house whenever um, is something that they, you know, was a decision that they made that they regretted. Uh, and so hence they chose to take it out of the game very quickly. It was originally put into the game as a cool mount. And to be a bit of a gold sink, um, but very quickly they realised that, hang on, hang on. They, they they wanted to squish it, I think, as quick as possible because they realised that long term, long term, they don't want everybody to have their own personal auction house. They already struggle massively when it comes to uh, incentivising players to engage with each other. At least if they bring all of the... And this is why, you know, the... Uh, this is why most cities don't have an auction house. An, an expansion might have an auction house in one zone um, because they use the auction house as a way to bring everybody to a central location to create that capital city mentality. Giving people access to the bank and mailboxes and stuff like that doesn't really matter anywhere near as much. But it's the auction house that pulls everybody to one spot. The number of long boys I see on some shards is crazy. Yeah, I mean, there's always those heroes, right? There's those heroes at the Ouroboros, uh, Ouroboros mailbox on their long boys all day. They are the real MVPs.